So you have a website, you built it with TV team and TV builder, and now you want to switch to another team or page builder, for example, Cadence or Veloxy team or Elementor. Seems like a nice idea, but maybe you don't know there is a problem. I'm going to show you what the problem is. This is a site built with TV. Looks good. All right. Everything is good. Now I'm going to go and deactivate TV Builder and switch teams and let's see what happens. As you see, I deactivated the TV Builder, installed Cadence Team, and now if I refresh the page, ah, what a mess. All sorts of shortcuts. Go figure what is what. And basically you lost all your content because cleaning this mess up takes lots of time if you do it manually. Therefore in this video I'm going to show you how to clean this mess up in a way that all those TV shortcodes are deleted and you will be left only with a plain text on the site. Since it's gonna take only a couple of minutes then dive in. First thing, I already activated another team. It's a Cadence team but it also the Bloxy team is a really cool, good team. Whatever team you use, this solution works with every team. But if you're interested in getting the discount for Cadence or Bloxys, then take a look at the description of this video. There is a link with the discount code. So, DV is deactivated, Cadence is activated. Now let's search for Buy by DV. As you see, the SeanBarton.co.uk is the first link. I'm going to put the link to the description of this video. Read everything Sean is writing here and now download this plugin. Next go to plugins, add new and now upload and activate the Buy by DV plugin. After that go under the settings Buy by DV and run a test. It doesn't do anything, just shows you that this is the before and this is the after. If you're satisfied with it, then just press on the Buy by DV button. But there is a one thing I would suggest you to do. Go to the plugins, add new and search for WP Vivid plugin. Why I suggest you to do that is that we're going to make a backup before we clean up the DV shortcode mess. So I'm going to activate it. Next I'm going to select the database plus files and now I'm going to click on backup now. Now it depends on your site size, it may take a couple of minutes or 20 seconds, it depends on your site size. So the backup is done, now I'm going to go to the settings, buy by TV, click on it, ok. It took uh, approximately a couple of seconds, now I'm going to open up the site and there it is. Only text, links and so on. As you see, it removed also the images and it's because the DV has the image links between the short codes. Therefore, there are no images, but all the text are there. Same with this page and this page. So if you're satisfied with the result the Bye Bye DV did for you, then go back to the Sean Barton site, find this uh, donate button and buy uh, Sean a beer. This way you can thank him for doing the hard work for you. If I'm not satisfied with the solution, I'm going to go to the WP Vivid, select it, click on restore, once again restore. Now it's gonna take a bit time, once again it depends on your site size. For me it took approximately 20 seconds, therefore I see the sign that restore completed successfully, ok. Refresh, once again there are the Short codes. Now I'm gonna go and activate the DV, DV team and DV builder. Now I'm gonna refresh and my DV site is back up. So, as you saw, with a couple of clicks, I cleaned all the DV mess, and with a couple of clicks, I restored it. And you can do the same if you're not satisfied with the result. If you find this tutorial helpful, then press thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, and this way you can support me. But before you go, take a look at the next video you see on the screen right now, because it's also full of useful content. Meanwhile, take care.